everyone this is Lovecraft girl welcome back to my channel today we're doing a Daiso haul now um, the haul that I'm going to show you is based off of just one store usually I do three stores gather all my stuff and then do a haul video for you guys but I haven't been to two of my stores that I love going to just because it is a little further from home and for me to do those um, um, runs to those like stores I would have to make a day of it like if I'm going towards that direction I'm not only gonna go to Daiso but I'm gonna go like to Dollar Tree I'll probably go to Michaels and go have lunch and so I make it into a day and I really haven't had a day off to actually do that um, on the weekends I don't do any of that because I tend to hang out with my friends um, but when we have a day off at work I tend to do those different little uh, adventures of going somewhere else just to like see what's out there but but for the last um, couple of months, I decided just to go to the Daiso near me, which is only 10 minutes away. And I thought, let's just see what they have. So back in September, I d went and I bought some stuff. Um, I've been holding on to it for a while. And then a few days ago, I went back and I found more stuff. So I thought, I'll just show you guys what I have found at one store. For me, um, it's still fun to find something new there. Uh, but usually when I go to all three, every single time I do that, there's always something different in each store. So that is why, like for me, I like to go to all the other two stores because I know what I didn't see in one or two stores, another one would have it. So for now, I'm going to keep it this way. I do plan on doing um, another run, hopefully in November. We'll see. But for right now, I'm going to show you what I got. So the first thing I'm going to show you is... I got this water bottle. Now, a lot of things I'm going to show you are things that I have shown you before in my other videos, uh, just because I either wanted to get more of it or it's um, a gift that I'm going to be giving. So I will explain to you guys what I got and for what reasons I got it if it's repeated. So for instance, this water uh, container, I bought one that had Mickey Mouse on it. I use it a lot for lunch. I take it to work and I love it. So I decided to get another one, but this one I wanted to be plain so I can put whatever I want on the bottle. I'm thinking some stickers or something like that, but I really wanted one like this that I could put in my purse. So when I go out, if I come across a water fountain, I could refill my bottle it'll be easy to do so with this bottle um, plus it's a small one it fits nicely in my purse since my purse is small I don't have enough room to buy any flasks that are bigger in size or even taller in size so this is cute I love it I love the other one that I have so I'm looking forward to uh, making like a DIY with that bottle okay so the next thing I got are these um, two plastic containers pouches I mean um, you see me buy these before I've shown you different um, styles different shapes different colors and different um, pictures on these uh, I think the ones I got were let me see I have it right here one of the ones I got I have two of them so I'll put these to the side the first one I got was this big one right here. I know you saw this one. It's got the pineapples. It says welcome vacation. I actually st stashed in all my extra stuff that I bought at um, the Daiso last time. And I thought, you know what? It fits a lot of stuff in here for being the size that it is. So I was happy about that. And then I got this other one, which is a different, um, different size as well. Uh, it also has an ice cream cone like this one right here. Has this ice cream. The only difference is that this one is smaller, as you can see, it's a tinier one. Um, but in this one, I put all my washi tapes. Now, these are only washi tapes of uh, animals. Um, I did like a new uh, way of putting my washi tape in containers, and so I've been splitting everything up into themes. And I felt like this would be perfect just for those types of washi. So they're in this bag. I know what's in here. Uh, so when I went and got these, I went and got them for birthday gifts. Last time I bought two bags, a big one and a medium size for my friend. She loves it. She's using it one for, I think she said for washi tape and the other one for makeup. So she's enjoying that. And I thought it'd be kind of nice to add this to, with my friend's birthdays coming up. They love ice cream. And I thought, why not give them each a little ice cream pouch to go um, for their gift? So that's that for them. Then I also decided to get uh, a new box of a soap container. The last time I went, I got a blue one and it had a little happy face on it. And so I got a new face wash soap and I didn't want to put it in the same container where I have a different soap in it. So I thought I'll just go and get another smiley face of a different color, which I think they have like pink, yellow, and purple. I believe that's what the colors I have. But then when I went looking for that, I found this. And so I'm like, okay, if it's Hello Kitty, it has to come home with me. So this is the one I got. 
lot. I can't wait to put my soap in it. It's super cute and I'm so happy that I found that. The next thing I found was, well, this one I was curious about. Um, they had three different kinds. They had the white, the gold, and the silver, but each one of them are for different reasons. I think one is a deep puffer, so I guess if you have puffy eyes, um, you put that on. The other one, I can't remember what the other one was for, and so I thought, well, I don't really have any of the other two things happening right now under my eyes, but I just really wanted to have like something to cool under my eyes, so I figured this would be maybe a nice way to start as a skincare uh, trying it out and of course I feel like if I do ever have puffy eyes or something I'll get the other ones but for now I'm going to try these out and see how they uh, you know how they feel and how I react to it hopefully I don't have a reaction to it because if I do then I won't be able to use them but I thought I would try something new with this I also got myself a new uh, eyeshadow brush uh, I have one of these already and I really like this one I also got one of these um, the last time I went I bought one that has uh, seashells on it but I wanted another uh, jar uh, I started to notice that the one with the seashells I think the pump was different so this one is an actual like pump I think the seashell one is a spray and so when I saw this I thought it'd be perfect to have um, and put some lotion in it that way I could just you know pump out some lotion and put it on my arms so I figured it would be kind of cute to have and I might go get some different ones of different kinds um, now that I know that these come in different um, type of pumps, whether it's a spray or a pump, I'm going to look at the products that I already have here at home, see where I could um, maybe re-put it into a different jar. That way they can all be the same, but for different things. So I'm going to look around and see what I might use it for. And then if I need more of these types, um, I'll go get more. Now, I also got myself a pair of socks. I thought these were super cute. It has this little rainbow with like stars at the end and it's a really nice one it feels really nice so I figured I'll try these out and see how they do and if I like them I might just keep buying some socks when I go over there I had one of these uh, which had like little succulents all around I bought one for work and I used the entire pad that I was missing it out for this year so I went and got it but I've been holding on to it to show you guys this pad so I can take it to work um, but I really need this I use it all the time I wrote down what what's gonna happen that week that way I had something to look um, to every time I was at my desk um, and I could plan whatever I need to do for um, whatever day is coming up but I love this and I'm so happy that I got a new one and it's kitty cat one so I can't wait to use that then I found these cute magnet bookmarks they are so cute I have to do the white side so you can see it. Um, they had dogs. I think they had little succulents. They might have gone had other little animals. Um, but I like the kitty cat ones, so I went for these. Then I got another. I got more of these uh, page flags. I bought the last time I bought these were otters. Um, it was blue, but I ran out of those, so I went and got myself these flamingos. They're super cute. Also got myself a new hole punch for my. Uh, desk at work. I had another one of a just a regular hole punch, but it broke and I thought why not try one of these These are small. This is a smaller one easier for me to store plus. It's really heavy So I was like intrigued to try this one out. They came in different colors I think they had pink yellow and green if I'm not mistaken, but I went for the blue because I like blue um, I'm gonna put my name on the top here that way. I know it's mine and no one can take my uh, hole punch I got two packs of these. These are word cards. This is like a way to study, uh, write little notes in there. And I, if you need to study, you can just carry your little note cards with you. Um, I was going to use flashcards, but I decided just to get these instead. They're really cute. They're all different. And it's going to work for me because I have an exam that I have to study for. And this is going to come in handy. Um, I can use each one of these for a particular subject. That way I can focus on one at a time. But I thought these are perfect. They had different kinds, which it's really cool to see uh, but I really wanted one with the little hooks that I could just carry around then I went into the aisle of the pens and the pen that I got is this one right here this is really pretty and I know you're gonna say didn't I see these before I actually bought these before and I have these two right here so the difference between the three is that they're all different colors of the barrel pink uh, like a beige and a baby blue but also what's different is the color of this so this is silver this one is gold 
and this one is rose gold so i thought it'd be kind of cool to have a little collection of these pens they're actually really good pens i actually like them a lot so i'm kind of glad to have gotten this the third one maybe they'll come up with another one in the future we'll see also in the pen aisle i found this really cute uh dolphin one it came in yellow and pink but i want the blue one i think it's really pretty i can't wait to try this one out i also found this one of a sugar skull i thought it was pretty cool i was like this is kind of nice it's cool different but then i was wondering why is it in this container i mean can it just be a loose one that you just pull and just take but then i read it um really really carefully and it's a scented pen and I was like, uh-oh, I can't wait to see what this is. It says black cherry on here, so I can't wait to open this and smell it and see if it's any a, a good smell, not an overpowering smell. Hopefully it's really good. Then I got myself um, this cute little pen. I think it's super cute. Look at this. It's got a little cupcake. It's blue. And then I looked at it carefully, and it says again, scented. I was like, oh my gosh, another scented pen. I love it. So I decided to get the collection. And so I got that one. I got the pink one. It's so cute. I love it. And I got the brown one. And this one says, I love biscuits. So it's going to be so cute. Hopefully it's not going to be overpowering, but I can't wait to try these out. Um, I also got my cat, another cat necklace. Um, I bought one of these the last time. I think I bought a the same one and purple and red she's actually using the red one right now but i really love the pattern to this so i decided to get her another one and also these are really hard to find at the stores this was the only one they had left hanging um the whole area of the collars this was empty so i decided just to get this last one because it's always good to have extras you never know sometimes the cats lose them sometimes um, it starts to come apart so I felt like having a backup is always great plus I always like the one with the bow and the little chime on it. it's really cute so as I was walking around I came upon these cute little pouches um, this one is really cute it's got unicorns and cotton candies and sweets like that this is actually a pouch to put like cookies or um, any type of sweets that you want to give somebody maybe you, you bake something you want to put them in a little pouch that's what these are for but i'm going to use it to put like um gifts in it either if i buy my friends like necklaces or bracelets i can put them in a cute little pouch or i could put washi tape or whatever small item i don't want to lose in the bag that i put it in it could go in this really cute little bag and there's a little sticker here that you could just like stick to the end of that fold of your bag so i thought it was cute I also found this one. This is of Winnie the Pooh. These are also little pouches. It brings five of these, but I was hoping they would have different designs, but they only had the Pooh Bear. So hopefully the other designs will come. And the reason I say other, and I have a feeling they're gonna have other, is because of the next thing I have here. So I found origami paper. And if you can tell, it's pretty much the same as the bag. So this is why I feel like they might have other um, patterns of other characters. And I'll, see, I'll show you right now. So we have the Winnie the Pooh one here. And it actually brings five different um, styles of paper. I'm trying to show you without having to glare. It's really cute. I love this. They also have Monsters, Inc. Oh my gosh. I mean, seriously, how cute is this? Now, this actually goes with all the other stuff they have um, that's related to, like, the characters. Like, they have the little note, oops, the notepads, um, sticky notes and stuff like that. And so, I was hoping to find all of these. So, I found also the Minnie Mouse. There's no Mickey in this one. It's just Minnie Mouse, actually. So, maybe in the near future, I'll find Mickey Mouse. Hopefully, they'll have that. But these are all mini. Except for these two, these are just the, you know, Mickey Mouse symbol ones. But I thought these were super cute. Um, then I found the last one, which is the princess ones. <gasps> Aren't they the cutest? They're so cute. Now, these also have five designs. Let's see if I can zoom it in for you. That's really, really cute. I love these. So I was so... Sorry, it keeps falling. I was so happy to have found those because... It was like, the, I found these back in September, and now that I went a few days ago, they didn't have any of these um, 
origami paper ones. So hopefully at the other Daisos, I'll find maybe the same or the different ones. We'll see. Hopefully we'll keep my fingers crossed for that. And then the other thing I got was this one for my friends. It's a um, transfer sticker, so uh, they can just share this. Well, obviously they can't, you know, each share, but they can at least maybe take half of the of the stickers. But super cute, and I thought they would like this to add into their birthday gift. So now everything else I have here is going to be pretty much washi tape related. So I'm gonna clear off this table first, and then we're gonna bring in the washi tape and show you what I got from that. Okay, now that we cleared up the table, let's go on to the next part of this haul. So I'm gonna show you some bigger pieces before I go into that. Um, the one thing I did get was this really cool pouch. Um, it's an envelope pouch of Winnie the Pooh. I think it was super cute. And it brings two. So this one's an orange and the other one's like a blue purpley one. I thought it was super cute and I really liked this. So I was glad I got my hands on that. And I also got two of these pouches. I'm just going to show you one of them. I got two bags of, of Mickey Mouse and Pluto. I'm going to use these for birthday bags for my friends um, since they love uh, bur um, Mickey Mouse and ice cream and all other things. I figured it would be kind of cute to add this to their birthday. So um, I got two of these, one for each of them, and I can't wait to put this together and see their reaction to their bags and all the goodies I got them. Okay, so on to the next part. So let me get the washi tape here. The first thing that I got were these tape runner that have decoration on them it's really cute they all say i think they all say happy birthday oh well no it's just decoration saying happy birthday but you can decorate it with like the images and so let me show you the images so this one has guinea pigs on them so whatever you see around the tape that's what you're going to have inside the tape because at the very top it shows you the images as if you were to uh, put it onto paper so they have that one then they have the panda ones I think it's super cute and then you have the kitty cat ones I love this it's so so cute so I'm glad I found these they were only three so hopefully maybe they'll have um, different ones in the future we'll see I found this one as well now I know I bought this one already but I bought this for my friends um, because I thought they would like a little panda one to have in your collection of washi so I figured I'll give them this for their birthday so that's for them I also got all these right here let me get them out and put them on the table these are all the Mickey Mouse ones that they have right now um, they are always constantly filling up the area of the washi tape section for Mickey Mouse. Um, every time I go, they're still there or they'll just like, maybe they'll have part of them and then the other ones that are not there will come in the next time. So they go back and forth with the same ones that I've seen before back in April, the same ones I hauled. But these are for gifts and I just wanted to show you guys that these are still around. So I got them the Mickey Mouse one that's in silver and in gold. I think it's kind of cool. I got them this one right here. It's a sweeties. It's really cute. And I got them these. Because it's kind of like a birthday. I feel like it's like a birthday theme with this and this one too. So I thought this is kind of cute to go with their birthday um, gifts. So I got them that. So the other thing that I got is this container. Now this one's not that big. It's pretty small, but I like it. It's really nice. I love the color of the handle. Again, it's blue. <laughs> um, but the reason I got this is because I always buy those felt kits at Daiso. But when I work on those, I tend to always put them in random places when I'm not done with them. So I figured I should just have a little container where I put all the supplies that I'm using for that particular uh, felt. Like I need to sponge the needle I have a little um, like a little mitten that you put over your finger so that you don't poke yourself you know all the little essentials that I need for when I'm working on a felt kit and so I figured this would be a nice place to keep it at I just put all my stuff in here and then whenever I'm ready to uh, do some felting I could just get my little container and open it up and continue where I left off and of course when I'm done with it I could just put a new little packet in there and you know start whenever I can again so that's why I got this container I think it's really cool I love it um, I will say I'm using it for washi tapes but I have a lot of washi tape containers that I really need to just you know make sure it just stays in the washi tape department but who knows maybe in the new future I might have to get another one of those for that but we'll see because 
Halloween has come and it's coming with a lot of washi tapes. So first thing with this is this is the Halloween sticker flake that they came out with. It's the only one I saw there. So I don't know if they have a different one coming out or like I said, every store is different. So I have to go and check out the other stores. Hopefully they'll still be there when I go back, but who knows? Um, I also found these random washi tapes. This is flamingos with gold foil on it. It's really pretty. And I got the pineapple. It's a silver pineapple. I don't know if I have this one. I know I bought a pineapple one at Daiso. But I don't know if it's a different color of pineapple or the same as this. If this is repeated, I will just put it into my friend's um, uh, birthday bag. And that, that way they can have an extra little gift into their bags. Okay, now with Halloween washing. This is the last bit of stuff I have. I'm looking around making sure I don't forget anything. But I think I got everything. So here it is. Here's the first Halloween wash tape I found. This is really, really pretty. I like this one. I like this one. It's really nice. It's so pretty. I got that one. I got this really cool vintage one. It looks vintage. But it's really hard to see. But it's like a little bunny, a bear. They're wearing like their little costumes. Little, it's like a little party. It's really cute. I actually like this one. It was so pretty. I got this ghost one. Now, of course, I don't know if I have this one. I feel like I do, but I don't know. I have to just go through my stash again and see if, if I do. Well, it goes into the birthday bag. Um, I got this glittery one, which I think is really pretty. It's a trick or treat. It's so pretty. I got another glittery one of monsters. I think it's another pretty one as well. So pretty. I got this pumpkin one. Now again, this one, I don't know if I have it. If I do, I'll give it to my friends again. Now, they did have a lot of wash tapes that I got last year. So I knew already the ones I already had. Um, so I didn't get those again. But you never know. Sometimes you think you don't have one and then you end up having it. So that's something I have to go do after I done with this video and I put all this stuff away I have to do the checkup and see what I have but this is cute this is a two different washi tape which I always like when there's doubles like this because you get two for the price of one um and I see another one right here this is this is sugar skulls now they had a different one and so they come in this box like a like a long box and in the box they're all rowed, like they're all in a row. But the, the the actual like top part of the box shows you all the different wash tips that the box brings. And so this one particular box where this one came from had a different sugar skull, and they didn't have any more of those. So I was so bummed out that I couldn't get my hands on it. Hopefully I can get my hands on it in the other store, but we'll see if I make it there. Then this one's just a big roll itself. There's no two in here, just one. But it's really pretty and cute. Here's another double one. This is two different washi tapes. It's really cute. It's really cute. I love this. And then my final washi tape is this one right here. Super cute. I love this. I was hoping for a glow in the dark one like they did last year, but they didn't have any more of those. So I was hoping for a new design. But overall, this was my entire haul for this time around. I'm looking forward to going back. Hopefully, there'll be two more videos for before the end of the year. I should have one uh, for the Christmas time and maybe for the fall. Hopefully, I'll have more things then. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you guys soon with another haul. Bye.